Hello everybody and welcome to episode 10 of Adeline and Gilbert. Well, we have made it all the way through the first 10. And I gotta say, I've been having a lot of fun with this little spin-off. Very humble so far, but I believe this will grow into something quite great. Now, today, remember last night, or last time I said that Gilbert doesn't work? Well, he does. I'm just a little confused by, you know, which color is which sometimes. But yes, the darker colors means that she does, or he does work. And she does work too, but look at, look at those hours. Holy crap. So, well, the medical field is very demanding, so at least that is simulated accurately. Gilbert, on the other hand, has some time. He has to, um... Get along with his teammates a lot better. Probably doesn't know him that well yet. But he does need to work out too. So do we know who his teammates are? Well that's his uh that's his boss. Hmm. Do we know Oh. Well it must be a um it must be a uh mixed gender team of some sort. Maybe they're maybe he's playing mixed tennis. Mm. You know, that's a such thing where there's a man and woman on each team. That's what I'm going to assume because I can't think of any other sport that has mixed uh, teams off the top of my head. But he has to be building up his um, stuff. He has to get to know his partner better, and maybe he and she can go work out together. I think that's probably a good way to get those skill points up. As for you, you still have to meet this person who lives over there somewhere, we have learned. And, well, you have to, she has to get her, lo well, her logic is high enough, but I want to get it higher. Plus, well, she does have to meet that person and read medical journals. She's going to be a busy, busy lady. But she wakes up at 7 every morning, regardless of how much sleep she's gotten, because... That must be in the ambitious thing. Only an hour to go, Adeline. Well, you use the chow the shower and the tub or the toilet and the shower, I should say. Tower and the sh tub, what am I talking about? As for you, Gilbert, you have a lot of time. So you need to be improving your skills here. Uh, what time are you getting up? 8.30? You can get up a little bit earlier. Oh no, Adeline's singing. And the reason is because I think they ought to give each other a big old smooch before Adeline goes to work. Very important, I think. Well, she's dressed for work, and there he is. So, who's she looking at? Oh. Nobody's watching. All right, off to work with Adeline. And for Aww. you, Gilbert, it's time to. Oh, we want to serve some breakfast. Serve some, uh, serve some pancakes, I guess. What's that? Learn gardening skill? It's all good. We can learn that sometime, although I don't really see it as a real priority. But he does want to do it, so we'll try to get that going for him at some point. Well, nothing going on but him cooking, so we'll speed it up to a reasonable speed. Yeah, he is the primary cook for this family. Which is true. Alright. So I'm thinking it's probably best for him to hit the gym after this. He does work. He does work at. What time would that be? Well, two, two of the carpool arrives. Oh, get. Have one. You didn't burn it this time. Good job. Hmm. Alright, so you nom nom it up. 
I think they decreased the amount of time that eating takes from uh, the original, or from Sims 2 rather, just because it really is, it really did take a long time there, so I guess I can't blame them too much for wanting to reduce that amount of time. Five different skill points. Not even Adeline says that she has five different skills. But I think when you tally up these tallies, Olivia or Adeline still has more. So that is a okay. All right, and then why don't you call your teammate and chat with her a little bit? I'm thinking she he does have two days off, so maybe he'll use some of that time to work out. I mean, maybe he'll work out a little bit now, but yeah, chat with her. Oh, well, that was a great chat. I'm glad we did that. By the way, anything else we need to clean in here? It's probably important to figure that out. I don't think so. Oh, you can recycle the papers. That's starting to look a little ridiculous. Actually, no, you don't. You, actually, no, you do need to do that. Better idea. Well, uh, come on. Yeah, there we go. That's going to be a lot easier for you. And then you're going to have some time before, too, so go ahead and work out once you've finished uh, getting rid of these papers. Having a blast. He's very happy just to be outside. Hmm. <laughs> Don't work without getting all smelly. Well, he wants to get smelly. Carpool comes in an hour. Okay, well, I think we will have him shower before work. Because he is getting stinky rapidly. Maybe doing the don't break a sweat thing is actually worth it at certain times. <clears throat> don't worry, we hear it. We're coming. We are coming. By the way, who's driving that? Is that his partner? Yep, there she is. There's Willow. Stupid clumsiness. <laughs> we'll have to, um,. Try to fix that if we can. All right, you're going to be there until nine. We're going to flip back over. Oh man, watch TV in the ready room. Meet medical personnel, chat with coworkers, do process paperwork. Look at all these options we have. Ooh. Ah, uh, yeah. Let's do it. Go to that game. When is that game, by the way? Uh, Friday before that time. Okay, well, that's fine. Who knows? Maybe Adeline can go with you. Oh, look. She's going to be exiting at any moment now. What's that? Eat at the Bistro? I don't know. We got other stuff. Other stuff you want. Alright, here she comes. Alright, oh, we didn't think about what we wanted her to do. Do you have medical journals in your pocket now? Oh, she does. Okay. Well, yeah, how about you go home? It's the best thing I can think of for you. She's on call and has to return. Wouldn't that be wild if she had to return after all that? Play the guitar? Well, you can do that to work out. How close are you to this? Getting pretty close. Alright. Whoa. We'll turn around there at the end. Okay, Adeline. But you come on in. It is rather dark in your house. And well you are on you are on call, right? So I assume that's gonna beep if we need it, but 
Wow, that's a long, that's a long title. But you're going to read your medical journal. Maybe you'll enjoy it. I don't know. Probably won't. Oh, no. She actually gets enjoyment out of reading her medical journal. That's pretty helpful, actually. And I can't imagine it takes too long. But yeah, what an exhausting job she has. And she might be able to finish this before um, Gilbert goes, gets home. So, looking pretty, looking pretty good. Almost got it. Good job, Gilbert. Oh, he has no moodlets at all. That's an, that's an interest. That's different. Oh, you're tired. Um, have some pancakes. And when you get home, you have some pancakes too. Oh, look. Look at those green shiny shoes. Well, the couple is going to eat together. And look, he has the attractive company moodlet because, of course, they are still madly in love and madly attracted to one another. Oh look, the team is a llama, so he has a llama. Once again, choking at everything in sight. Oh, got on a bee woo. What's he talking about? Begging for a raise? Is that what it was? I don't know. Computers. They're funny, aren't they? Well, you know, ladies and gentlemen, it's going to be time for bed soon, so why don't we hit that good old button? Oh no! Well, guess what, Gilbert? You have work tomorrow. You have something to do tomorrow. But we're not going to worry about it for tonight, because it's late. And Adeline, especially, wants to get to bed early. Well, ladies and gentlemen. There is only one way to end this day. But, however, we are going to press a slightly different button. Aha. Uh -huh. Aha. Uh -huh. Sweet, Nona. Mm, Oh man. Well, that sound may indicate something. It may. But you can feel free to sleep because you're very tired. Don't. No. Go to sleep. All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that does bring us to the end of this episode. This has been the shortest episode in the history of ever. But it might turn out to be a very monumental episode. So I want to thank you guys for watching. And join us again as the exciting adventures of Adeline and Gilbert continue.